What? What? Hello everyone and welcome to Soul Show. My name is Soul and I'll be your host for this review. And today we are talking about the debut album by Boots. If you're unfamiliar with Boots, his place in the music industry for the most part has been behind the scenes. He is a super talented producer working with artists from the likes of Run the Jewels all the way to Beyonce. Sarford. And holy shit, this album right here, it is an instrumental clusterfuck of beauty. Boots meshes the likes of rock, hip-hop, pop, and it all meshes into this very cool sound. The song Cure, which is my personal favorite from the album, really shows Boots' potential, what with its very fast-paced beat and his very synthetic voice on this track, and you know, he's rapping in this track, and he actually has a really good flow. However, if we're talking about vocals, I think the downside to this album is on the vocal side. On tracks such as Earthquake, Dead Come Running, Still, his tone and pitch aren't really changing much at all. He has this very just kind of flat, uh, singing voice, and on a song like Oracle Eyes, it's a very, it's a very cool song and it works really well there. But on a song like Earthquake, where the instrumental is very standard compared to the rest of the album, it just doesn't mesh as well to me. And don't get me wrong, I don't think there is a bad song on this album. It's just songs like I Run Roulette or Brooklyn Gamma, those are more up my alley compared to some of the other ones. And as far as lyrics go with this album... I, I, I just don't know much of what he's trying to convey. Cure, you're probably going to get a song like Cure if you look into that one. It's very easy to understand. It's sort of like this uh, anthem for deception and like shady business and stuff like that. But there are some examples I just, I just don't know. I have some lyrics on this piece of paper right here in front of me and I would love to hear your interpretation of this. When I'm running, your tongue is broken glass, hurricaning. That's a hook. If I had tits, you'd go all over me, worldwide, flick my clit, I'll blow it globally. I'm sure, I'm sure there's a context to that that I'm just not getting. Jokes aside, I honestly really did like this album. Boots showed me what he could do instrumentally, and lyrically, and even though vocally he didn't, you know, do a whole lot on certain songs, on songs like Here or I Run Roulette, he really showed he could make a song I could really fuck with. Anyway, um, oh no, oh not this again, I need an adult. And with all that being said, I give Boots Aquaria an 8 out of 10 and the soul badge of approval. With all that being said, guys, as always, stick around for the credits for some other cool videos. You can support me on Patreon, and I would super appreciate that. Follow me on Twitter and all that good stuff. And with all that being said, guys, thank you for watching. I love you. Have a wonderful day. And with that, I leave you. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Every Song Reviews. Today, we are looking at this guy, Boots, and his... Uh, I believe debut album, I'm like 99% sure, debut album uh, called Aquaria, I believe that's how you pronounce it, Aquaria. Um, I'm going into this one a little bit more blind, I've heard uh, a couple of these songs, but it's, there's like this big meaning to the album that uh, I haven't discovered yet.